Hey everybody, Y5150 here. Because I am Y5150, of course. So, you probably already see my video already. Uh, the glory of Uncharted 2 coming back onto Uncharted 4. Pretty cool, right? Yeah, the, this beta that is on the playlist. You can just play it yourself. Go on Uncharted 4 multiplayer. Play the beta. Anyone can play it. Whoever has the game, of course. But, what's the amazing part about it is a, they, they kind of combine... Two of the greatest things about Uncharted 4's multiplayer and what people uh, let me put my hand back. What people uh, used to love about Uncharted 2. Now, what they did that they uh, first off the first thing I noticed was that people's movement, like your character's movement, was slower. You didn't go as fast as you used to, which was kind of weird. <laughs> You're used to moving at a certain rate, so when they changed it, which the original beta didn't have for that classic mode, it really felt weird. Also, the, the classic mode, the last one, they had, um, they tried to make it kind of Uncharted 3 slash 2, didn't really work. People wanted Uncharted 2, because Uncharted 2 was the glory days. Now, they did it. They, they, they made, uh, hero rep weapon spawns, not heavy weapons, or... Power weapons, as I used to call them. Uh, they, they just have them out, just like as you would see in Uncharted 2. Except these would switch out. So not always the grenade launcher spawns at the grenade launcher spot, as you would think. Sometimes it might be RPG, might be a Baruch. But hey, a power weapon or heavy weapon, hero weapon, whatever you want to call a weapon. It is there, and you can use it to your advantage. Just like the classic game. The classic multiplayer, that is. Now, loadouts are almost completely useless. They made it only... You can have two guns. You can modify the guns, which is great addition from Uncharted 4 multiplayer. Uh, but then, all, most of the boosters don't really work because they're geared towards Uncharted 4. There's no revenge booster. There's no... Uh, well, actually, there's kind of a... What's that booster called? Situation awareness. Yeah, the, you know, when you shoot somebody... It, it, there's boosters where you can mark people, okay? And it's similar to it, so you can have that good little bit. Uh, the best part about this is what you saw with the gameplay in that video, which I'll have it in the link below. Or heck, I'll put a notation right in front of my face if you want me to. Uh, well, what happens is you, when you die, you die. It's not like Uncharted 4 where you die, you gotta be revived by someone else. If you die, you're gonna wait for the respawn countdown. That's what's gonna happen. And that's why I like the best about it, because, you know, I mean, I liked what The Last of Us brought, you know, the healing factor thing, but there's something so satisfying with that ding, is what I crave from uh, Uncharted. I mean, that's why I play Uncharted 2 for so long. I just play just for the bing, ding, 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 ding. I love it. But you know what, that, that brought it back. Brought back the good times and it added more stuff. It was like a, a spiritual sequel to the multiplayer, which was Uncharted 2. I mean, Uncharted 4 was like everything. It's everything's great about Uncharted 4. I think. I think it's well balanced. Has ton of content nowadays, and the co-ops, the survival is good. I like it. But this classic mode just adds to everything. And the King of the Hill beta, the last one, was good too. I liked it. Get a lot of points from it too. Hey, but hey, I want you guys to comment down below. Yeah, where's my finger at? It's down there. Yes, you you comment down there below. Tell me what you think. I'll have a conversation or argument with you. Let's go. Come on. I think Uncharted 4 is the best multiplayer I've ever played. Even better than Uncharted 2. And I'm gonna soon put more hours into it than Uncharted 2, which is hard to say because I put so many hours. If you guys want to know, just ask. I'll tell you. Well, thank you for listening to me. Bye bye. See you next time. Fading out. Blech.